when I was younger. I was like very obsessed with the 60s, mostly through my parents' record collection. Listening to certain music is transportative. It's a time travel machine, essentially. Edgar loves film and music so much that you cannot help but be inspired when you are around him. The music really anchors you into the time and place. It's almost like the music takes you by the hand to just guide you through the experience. I wanted to use a lot of the female singers of the 60s, Dusty Springfield, Sandy Shaw, Petula Clark, Cilla Black. A lot of those songs are both extremely melodic, but also there's something a little dark to them, which is a reflection of Sandy's experience coming to London as an aspiring singer. So what do you do, Sandy? Well, I sing, of course. Things will be great when you're downtown. No it's quite nerve wracking to stand on a stage and just sing, but it was such an incredible experience. Just seeing Anya sing on screen is bewitching. When you're watching the movie, in the same way that her going into a dream world is totally immersive, the sound is starting to kind of draw you in. But these dreams are not all that they seem to be. The emotion that you feel through music was really important to me because it seemed to encapsulate the theme of the entire movie. Down, down.